You think you've had a bad day? Try getting your brain hacked by a fungus that wears you like a Halloween costume. And no, this isn't a sci-fi movie. This one's 100% real. Deep in the humid rainforests of South America and Asia lives a fungus so freaky, so diabolical, it makes Hollywood horror ah. look like a kid's bedtime story. Its name? Ophiocordyceps, the zombie ant fungus. This thing doesn't just kill ants, it mind controls them, makes them climb to their doom, and then, wait for it, bursts out of their heads like it's auditioning for Alien 6 Nature's Revenge. Let's crawl into this tiny nightmare of life, death, and mind control. Picture it, the rainforest floor, damp, buzzing, alive, ants marching in military precision like they're auditioning for Ants the Musical. They're organized, disciplined, unstoppable. But for one poor ant, things are about to go very sideways. As it's out foraging, a single invisible fungal spore floats through the air. Boop! Lands right on it. No big deal, right? Wrong! This spore is basically a microscopic brain hacker. It digs in, eats through the exoskeleton, and before long the fungus is renting space in the ant's body like a bad Airbnb guest. At first, the ant goes about its business, but inside, oh, it's getting possessed. Soon, the ant's brain is no longer its own. The fungus has the wheel. And hey, before this fungus crawls into your brain, smash that like button. Don't test fate. Do it before you start climbing walls and locking your jaws onto a leaf. Our unlucky ant starts acting weird. It stops following the colony trail and just wanders off like it forgot what Wi-Fi is. Scientists think the fungus releases chemicals that hijack the ant's nervous system, like installing malware in an insect. Then it climbs and climbs, like it's possessed by the spirit of a motivational speaker. Reach higher, Jerry! Find your purpose! Eventually, it finds the perfect leaf. Humid, shady, real estate gold for fungus. The ant clamps down hard in what scientists call the death grip. Once those jaws lock, that's it. No take backs. And right there, the fungus kills its host. But death? Oh, that's just chapter two. Days later, something straight out of a nightmare happens. From the ant's head, a dark stalk erupts. It grows slow and steady until it bursts open. Releasing a cloud of new spores, a fungal sneeze of death, raining down on the forest floor below, right where more ants are marching, and the cycle begins again. Imagine standing in that forest, looking up at leaves covered in ant corpses with sticks growing out of their heads. That's not sci-fi, that's Tuesday in the rainforest. If that doesn't make you hit like, buddy, check your pulse. For humans, this story hits deep. Losing control of your mind, becoming a meat puppet for some fungus, yeah, hard pass. But for the ant colony, it's just another day in the murder jungle. Some ants have even evolved defense systems. They can smell when one of their buddies gets infected, and they toss that guy out of the colony like a bad Tinder date. Quarantine, but make it savage. Here's the wild part. This fungus isn't just an evil genius, it's also a necessary one. It helps keep ant populations balanced, making sure the rainforest doesn't get overrun. Nature, as usual, is equal parts beauty and nightmare fuel. And scientists are studying Ophiocordyceps to learn how it rewires brains. Who knows, maybe one day it'll help us cure diseases, or invent the world's creepiest self-help app. So next time you think of zombies, forget Hollywood. Think of that tiny rainforest ant climbing higher and higher under the control of something it can't fight. It's a reminder that nature doesn't need special effects to be terrifying. And if you don't want Ophiocordyceps sliding into your DMs or your frontal lobe, hit subscribe right now. Otherwise, you might just wake up gripping a leaf with ah! mushrooms sprouting out of your skull. Hasta la vista, zombie ant.